Hello Cloud Experts, welcome to today's video. In this video, we are diving into the world of AWS certifications and answering the burning question, are they worth pursuing in 2024? AWS, the powerhouse of cloud services, offers a range of certification to elevate your career in the tech industry. But with the evolving landscape of technology, is investing your time and resources in obtaining an AWS certification still a valuable aspiration? We are going to find answer for this question. Before we explore the benefits, I would like to request you, if you are new to our channel or haven't subscribed yet, then please subscribe to our channel and please click on the bell icon to get notification for any new topics. To start with the benefits, every associate has a unique need to pass the certification. And we are going to explore what matches with your need. On a high level, we found there are main seven needs when an associate takes an AWS certification. And it starts with, it could be career advancement or skill validation, maybe a job requirement, or maybe he or she wants to staying ahead or could be due to salary increase, maybe entrepreneurship or personal development. But whatever the needs we found, there are four use cases where an associate takes AWS certification. Use case one, he or she does not have an AWS experience and wants to learn AWS cloud. Scenario two, maybe the associate is working with AWS services and he or she wants to showcase AWS expertise. Use case three, the associate works with AWS services and wants to switch job, maybe role, or maybe want a salary increase. And the last but not least, although there are a few of these categories, they want to achieve the certification as early as possible. They really do not want to spend that much time. They want to use dumps or any kind of illegal ways to get the certification and they just want to make their resume heavy. Since you are in this video and I'm considering you are not into category four, you have already considered to take AWS certification with the legal way. If you belongs to category four, then my request is you can stop the video here and look somewhere else because I do not have any content for you. Now let's explore the benefits. When you will pass any AWS certification, you will get one badge like this and you can put that badge into your resume, into your social media, maybe LinkedIn, Facebook, Twitter to showcase your knowledge. Now AWS certification aren't just badges. They are pathways to expertise and credibility in cloud computing. They validate your skills. Moreover, AWS certified professional often enjoy higher pay skills and better career opportunities. These certifications open doors to exciting opportunities from cloud architect to solution engineers and beyond. Now you might wonder with technology rapidly advancing, do the certification remain relevant? The answer is yes, absolutely. AWS consistently updates its certifications to keep pace with the latest tech trend. Every year with reInvent, AWS coming with a bunch of new services and they are making sure you are staying ahead with that new technology. That is why any AWS certification are valid for only three years and you have to recertify yourself within the three years. They want to ensure that your knowledge stays current and applicable. Now, when you are talking about the recertification, you have to take the full certification exam again. It's not like that if you will take two or three questions or a certain portion, you will get it recertified. The way you started your certification or the way you got your first certification, recertification is no longer different than that. Let me show you one of my experience. This is my AWS certification dashboard and I have total 
obtain AWS certifications. If you see here, AWS Certified Developer Associate, I missed that certification. And that is why it did not extend. Rather, I had to take a new version of the certification. Now, if you concentrate here on the data analytics piece, when you will recertify successfully, your start date will remain the older date. It will say that how long or how many years you are holding that certification. In my case, since the developer associate, I missed that certification. You can see, you can see a new date started for that certification. So I cannot claim I am developer certified since 2020 because it is expired in between. Now, after successful completion of any certification, you will get 50% discount voucher and that you can use for your recertification. But here's the key. Pursuing AWS certification is not just about the end certification. It's about the learning journey, the wealth of knowledge you will gain while preparing for this certification is invaluable. It will equip you with practical skill and deep insight into the AWS services. So the verdict in 2024, AWS certification remain an excellent investment in your career. It offers you a blend of knowledge, credibility and opportunity. It will guide you towards success in the dynamic technology industry. Keep learning, keep growing and let AWS certification be your gateway to a brighter future. Stay tuned for more tech insights until the next time. Before we go, I would like to again request you, if you are new to our channel or haven't subscribed yet, please subscribe to our channel and get notification for new videos. If you like our effort and if you find this video helpful, please like and share this video with your friends and families. Thank you again for your support and once again, best of luck for your certification.